and there are basically five pillars. The, f the first is we're, we're going to create a North Africa Young Entrepreneurs and Business Leaders Network. This is a network that will facilitate cross-border links by developing a closed regional online social network that will connect in the Maghreb and in the U.S. Young business leaders and entrepreneurs will be connected with each other, they'll be connected with potential investors, and they will be connected with other entrepreneurs uh, in the Maghreb and in the United States. The second aspect of our initiative we're calling the North Africa Innovation and Technology Incubator. All great ideas need incubators. All great ideas need capital. And this initiative will support the ongoing first steps of a Maghreb venture capital sector and provide regional access to seed and growth capital for small businesses. And it will also encourage startups, startup companies in technology and other sectors. We, even would, we would like to, to sponsor a, a regional startup initiative in new technologies for young entrepreneurs and support science, math, and technology training by sponsoring something that we're calling the Math Olympics, the US, the U.S. Maghreb Math Digital Media Competition. We will work with diaspora leaders and business leaders in the Maghreb to explore launching a North Africa Angel Capital Network, which will bring the angel capital concept, the startup capital concept, into the Maghreb to give young entrepreneurs access to early stage capital. You know, in, in the U.S., angel networks, what we call angel networks, which is basically startup uh, networks, are among the most important sources of funding for startups and early stage enterprises in the U.S. And these, in, these programs will, will assist those who need it the most young and new entrepreneurs with new ideas who want to make those new ideas a reality. The third part of the, of the initiative will be the North Africa Leadership and Training Academy, which will work with local and U.S. partners to strengthen leadership, management, entrepreneurship, and education to employment skills for uh, young people ages 16 to 35, the people who need it the most. We will do this through regional workshops, mini academies, and retreats. The fourth uh, aspect of our, of our initiative, we're calling the North Africa Creative Industries Incubator. You know, this is a region with an immense uh, uh, and a long artistic tradition. And it's, a, it's, an, it's an artistic tradition that could be used to support entrepreneurship. The North Africa Creative Industries Incubator will harness the potential of regional artists, of musicians, of filmmakers, writers, and digital media artists to contribute to job creation and to local development. We'll deliver training to assist artists and artisans to build and sustain businesses in the cultural sector and to promote cultural exports. Again, entrepreneurs in the cultural sector. The fifth initiative in our program, and this is the last one, is one that I hope will form the long-term backbone for this partnership. Our vision is that the partnership uh, that we outlined today will someday will be housed in North African centers of excellence for entrepreneurship, one in each Maghreb country. Uh, and we, we would like to, uh, to, to engage the, the private sector and the public sector in each of these countries to help us create these, uh, these centers. Uh, so we call on you, on entrepreneurs like you and all members of your business communities to mobilize with us around promoting entrepreneurship and to join with, with the Aspen Institute and the U.S. to make this vision a reality. Our hope is that the centers of excellence in each of the five countries will be networked together and work in concert with the Aspen Institute to make the U.S.-North African partnership a real success. These are the five initiatives, these are the five pillars of, of, the, uh, of the partnership, and over the coming weeks, we will look to private and public partners to help us bring this vision to reality. There's a role, there's going to be a role for everyone, regardless of, uh, of size or nationality. Let me end by just mentioning briefly uh, that we're also planning, uh, as part of, of, of the broader engagement, uh, two missions tied to this new partnership. One is a reverse trade mission of businesses and entrepreneurs from North Africa that will go to the United States, and an entrepreneurship mission from the U.S. to the Maghreb. The, uh, the reverse trade mission will be designed to spur U.S. company interest in pursuing new opportunities and projects here in the Maghreb. It will provide an opportunity for public and private sector representatives to travel 
to the U.S. to see equipment and technology in action, as well as to meet with U.S. companies and to meet with relevant U.S. government departments. The second mission is the entrepreneurship mission, and that will come to the region in the early spring of next year, in the next uh, three or four months. It'll, it's a mission that will include uh, about a dozen American investors, uh, including potential angel investors from the Maghreb diaspora community, investors who are interested in emerging companies, and uh, American entrepreneurs who are going to serve as models and, and to really kickstart the, the partnership. It's a delegation that will meet with local investors, with incubators, with training organizations, and with relevant government officials. Most importantly, the delegation will meet with individual entrepreneurs that are leading some of the most promising startup companies here in the Maghreb. We hope that you, that you will join uh, and that you will participate in that, that trade mission and that you'll be able to meet uh, the, the American uh, mentors that we will bring over. So let me just close by saying we've got, uh, we've got a long way to work uh, in, in this part of the world in terms of deepening our economic relations. Uh, we, we have made it a priority to be here. Uh, we believe that there are opportunities. We believe that uh, there, are, there, are, there are great uh, ways that our two peoples could work together to create a better society. We're working to move our world closer together by, meaningful, by building meaningful partnerships. And what I hope you will do over the next two days is, is talk about your stories and, and see if we can learn some concrete lessons that will help us grow and will help everyone uh, thrive as successful entrepreneurs. I also look forward to your help in growing what will be a successful and landmark partnership. Thank you. Thank you very much.